Good evening.
Good evening, people. Good evening. Good evening, teacher. <clears throat> okay. Okay, people, tonight we are going to start the last module, no, the last unit of this module, the last week. At the end of this unit, you have to complete, uh, you must have completed the homeworks for unit or and the final exam. At the moment, there are seven students still pending unit three homeworks. Hay siete que todavía están pendientes de la unidad tres. No la han terminado. Tenían que haberla terminado anoche. Ya. Hay unos que todavía están con nota de 60, otros de 20, otros cero. Necesito que esta noche me termine la unidad 3. Porque ya vamos a la unidad 4. Y para el martes próximo debe de estar terminada la unidad 4 y el examen final. Ahí sí ya no hay prórrogas de tiempo. Martes a la medianoche. Yo estoy subiendo las notas. Ok. Tal como está. Si el examen final está cero. Sorry. Le va a quedar a cero. Si la unidad 4 está a cero. A 20 o a 40. A eso les va a quedar. Dicen que en guerra cantada no hay soldado herido. Así es que se los estoy avisando. Porque a miércoles en la mañana revisan todo y ya deben de estar todo completo. Ok. Vaya pues. Su silencio otorga la razón. <risa> eh, así debe ser, ¿verdad? Así es que aprovechen el fin de semana para avanzar. ¿Ya? Porque aunque las cosas son fáciles, tiene su tiempecito para hacerlas, ¿verdad? Ya el martes a la medianoche no van a querer a las 10 de la noche no van a querer estar haciendo unidad 4 y examen. Así es que vamos ahí a avanzar. Hay algunos que ya lo hicieron todo. Está bien, no hay problema. ¿Verdad? Perfecto. Se puede. Se puede, ¿verdad? Porque recuerden que de ahí sacamos la nota. Ahora bien, yo sé que no estamos trabajando por una nota y en una plataforma solamente, pero el aprendizaje ya es otro piso. Pero para que aprueben el módulo y no tengan problemas con Insafor y puedan seguir con los módulos siguientes, sí hay que llenar la plataforma. ¿Ok? Any comments, any question? No, teacher. No, no right? Teacher. <clears throat> Perfect. So let's get started tonight with unit four. Unit four, lesson one. Unit four topic is tech support. Mm. 
this is the topic for you for. Tech support. At the end of this lesson, you will be able to make a phone call to report a problem. So that is what we are going to practice tonight. How to make a phone call to report a problem. All right? There are two questions here. Do you call tech support? And when do you do it? When do you call tech support? Two questions. Do you ever call tech support? Yes or no? Yes. Salvador says yes. Uh, only Salvador has called tech support? Me too, teacher. Edwin, okay. Salvador, Edwin. Nadie más necesita en, en su trabajo call tech support? Okay. Yes, yeah, Alberto says yes. I sometimes need to call tech support in, in, in this job, but sometimes Zoom is giving problems or the platform is giving problems. I need to call tech support or sometimes I need to call tech support of my internet company, which is Tigo, because I'm having problems with the internet. Like these two days before, I had some problems with the internet, so I need to call tech support. Yeah, sometimes I need to call tech support for my cell phone service because I have problem with my cell phone service. I need to call tech support, okay? Uh, in what, when, when do you call tech support? In what situation do you call tech support? Let's see, let me ask Edwin, Salvador, uh, Alberto, who said that they said the call them. Hello, Andres. When you know, you, when you don't know, do, do something or doing something. Ah, okay. When you don't know how to do something. Yes. Mm -hmm. In my case, I call to support to uh, configuration <laughs> of the system uh, uh, for the company. Ah, okay. For uh, setting. Setting. The setting, okay. Okay, yeah, that happened. Anybody else? Uh huh. Uh, my client. Uh, reserve product the the the, the company. Okay. Okay. Well, there are different reasons for, to call tech support. We are going to study that tonight. But first, the attendance, guys. I forgot the first attendance of the evening. Okay. Please respond. Alison Andrea Serrano. Present teacher. Okay. Thank you. Carla Jasmine Rivera. Sí, present. Okay. Carlos Jonathan Garcia. Daniel Ernesto Membreño. Present. Okay. 
Uh, Edwin Mauricio Pineda. Present teacher. Uh, Eric Mauricio Cruz. Present. Okay. Gilberto Benito Santa María. Present teacher. Okay. Jennifer Guadalupe Elías. Present teacher. Eh, José Andrés Martínez. Present teacher. Ok. Uh, Julio César Fabián. Present. Uh, Noé Gustavo Núñez. Present teacher. Ok. Omar Alexander Chávez. Present teacher. Ok. Raúl Edgardo Sarceño. Present teacher. Ok. Eh, Rosalina Esmeralda Sánchez. Present teacher. ¿A quién está mandando a dormir ya? <ríe> eh, Salvador Alberto Soriano. Present. Ok. Salvador, the personal session at the end of the class is with you tonight. Ok. Ok. Virginia del Carmen Vázquez. Present teacher. Ok. Eh, Vladimir Alejandro García. Present. Ok. Um, William Boris Roque. And William Rodrigo Ann. Very good. Okay, now we can start. Let's take a look to this short conversation between Peter and Robert, okay? I will read it and record it here in WhatsApp. Good morning, this is Peter from Tech Support. How can I help you? Hi, Peter, this is Robert. I am calling from the Human Resources Department. I like to report a problem with my computer. What is it, Robert? It doesn't seem to work. I see. Let me ask you some questions. Okay. One more time, listen. Okay. Good morning, this is Peter from Tech Support. How can I help you? Hi, Peter, this is Robert. I am calling from the Human Resources Department. I like to report a problem with my computer. What is it, Robert? It doesn't seem to work. I see. Let me ask you some questions. Okay. Very, very short. Let's practice. Repeat after me, please. Good morning. This is Peter from Tech Support. How can I help you? Good morning. Good morning. This is Peter, this is Peter from Peter Tech Support. Support. How can, How I, can help I help you? you? How can I help you? Hi, Peter. This is Robert. I am calling from the Human Resources Department. I like to report a problem with my computer. Hi, Peter. Hi, Peter. This is Robert. This is Robert. I am calling from the calling Human Resources Department. Department. I like to report like problems problem with, problem with, problem with, with my computer. What is it, Robert? Computing. What is it, Robert? What is it, Robert? It doesn't seem to work. It doesn't seem to work. Seem to work. I see. Let me ask you some questions. I okay. see. I see. Let me Let ask me you ask some questions. Question. Okay, very good. Now I am Peter and you are Robert, okay? okay? Good morning. This is Peter from Tech Support. How can I help you? 
Hi, Peter. Hi, Peter. This is Robert. This is Robert. I am calling from the human resources department. department. I'd like to report oh, like a problem, with, a problem, my problem with, my with my computer. What is it, Robert? It doesn't seem, it to, doesn't work. seem to work. I see. Let me ask you some questions. Okay, now you are Peter. You begin. One, two, three. Good morning. Good morning. This is Peter yes. from Tech Support. Tech support. How, can I help How, you? Can I help you? How can I help you? Hi, Peter. This is Robert. I am calling from the Human Resources Department. I like to report a problem with my computer. What is it, Robert? Yes. What well, is it, Robert? Yes. It doesn't seem to work. I see. I see. Let me Let ask, me you, ask some you some questions. Question. Okay, very good. Any question with the conversation? No, teacher. Okay. Teacher, uh, uh -huh. el, I do like, o, o es otra cosa, el que está con apóstrofe. I, I'd like to report uh -huh. a problem. Yes, I'd like it. I'd is the contraction for I would. Uh, no, it's do, it's would. Yes, let me write it here if this thing works. I would like. Okay, this. I'd is I would. Okay, thank you. I'd. Okay. Any other question, people? No, teacher. Okay, so I want you to practice the conversation in pairs and after that, respond these two questions. What is the issue with Robert's computer? Issue is synonym of problem, okay? Issue is synonym of problem. What is the problem? The issue, what is the issue is, what is the problem, okay? With Robert's computer. And the second question says, how does he report the problem? How does he or Robert report the problem, okay? So practice the conversation and respond these two questions. Let me send this to WhatsApp. And I'm going to form the groups. Oh. And Okay. Okay, join your groups, practice the conversation and respond the questions. See you in 10 minutes.
Okay, welcome back. Let's hear your conversation. Okay, let's start with Alison and Omar. Okay. Okay. Good morning. This is Peter from Tech Support. How can I help you? Hi, Peter. This is Robert. I'm calling from the Human Resource Department. I'd like to report a problem with me with my computer. What is this, Robert? I doesn't seem to work. I see. Let me ask you some question. Okay, very good. Thank you. Now, uh, Carla and Julio. Thank you. Um, Carla, empiezo o empieza usted? Hola. Carla. Okay. Um, Carla. La mesa. Hola, me sacó de la sala. Ah, okay. Ya okay. nos toca. Sí. A nosotros nos toca. Ok. Eh, sí. Empiezo. Sí. Ok. Good morning. Sí. This is Peter from Tech. Support how can help you. Hi, Peter. This is Robert. I am calling from the Human Resource Department. I'd like to report a problem. Why my compu computer? What What is it, Robert? It doesn't um, seem to work. I feel let me ask you some question. Okay. okay. Thank That's you. It. Now let's continue with Jose Andres and Virginia. Okay. Um, good morning. This is Pilar from Test Support. How can help catch you? Hi, Peter. This is Robert. I'm calling from the Human Resources Department. I would like to report a problem with my computer. Uh, what is it, Robert? It doesn't seem to work. Uh, I, I see. Let me ask you some question. Okay. Now, please. Edwin and Vladimir. Okay. Okay, I begin. Uh, good morning. This is Peter for Teach Support. How can I help you? Hi, Peter. This is Robert. I am calling from the Human Resources Department. I'd like to report a problem with my computer. What is it, Robert? It doesn't seem to work. I see. Let me ask you some question. Okay. Now, Noe and Rosalina. Okay. Good morning. This this Peter front edge support. Home care, I help you. Hi, Peter. This is Robert. I am calling from the Human Resources Department. I'd like to report a problem with my computer. What is it, Robert? It doesn't seem to work. I see it. Let, let, let me ask you some question. Okay. Now, please, Gilberto and Jennifer. Okay. Yes, Jennifer. Sí. Sí. Good morning. This is Peter from the support. How can I help you? 
Hi, Peter. This is Robert. I am calling, calling from the Human Resource Department. I'd like to report a problem with my computer. What is wrong? It doesn't seem to work. I see. Let me ask you some questions. Mm -hmm. Okay. And finally, Daniel and Salvador. Okay. I begin in Daniel. Hola. Empiezo. Okay. Good morning. This is a period from Tech Support. Support. How can I help you? Hi, Peter. This is Robert. I am calling from the Human Resource Department. I like to report a problem with my computer. What is it, Robert? It doesn't seem to work. To work. I see. Let me ask you some questions. Okay. Okay, very good. Um, it seems that you didn't have too much problem with this conversation. I said a couple of you with this with this word. Yeah. Word sending with th usually the pronunciation is like tech 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 como con, con una k al final no tech no es una t no es una ch k tech okay tech support tech support okay this contraction is I'd, I'd, I'd like, I'd like, I like to report a problem, I'd, I'd. Okay, basically that. Now, uh, what is the problem with Robert's computer? Can you tell me? It doesn't seem to work. Okay. It doesn't seem to work. And how does he report the problem? How? Call or telephone. Support. Calling tech support over the phone. Okay. Yeah. That's right. So the computer is not working. It doesn't seem to work. Es una forma de decirlo. ¿Verdad? Cuando algo no funciona, it doesn't seem to work. Okay. Now, we have here different vocabulary about uh, some reason or the most common reasons to call tech support. Let me read this vocabulary first and record it here. What's up? So you can practice it later. Um, okay, give me a second. The most common reasons to call tech support. New software, no internet access, a virus, deleted files, Paper stock in printer, 
USB ports out of order, funny noise in the CPU, frozen screen. Okay. New software, you know, what is that? What is the meaning of new software? Nuevo programa. Nuevo programa, ¿verdad? Nuevo software, que también así lo usamos. Nuevo software. No internet access. No hay acceso a internet. Mm -hmm. A virus. Un virus. Un virus. Deleted files. Archivos eliminados. Archivos Han borrado los archivos. Eliminados, borrados. Ok. Paper stock in printer. Papel atascado en la impresora. Ok. USB ports out of order. Puertos USB fuera de servicio. Ok. Funny noise in the CPU. Um, ruido divertido en la CPU. <laughs> sí, esta es una expresión, ¿verdad? Funny noise, sonido raro. O sea, <laughs> hay un ruido raro. Sí, no, no directamente lo traducimos como divertido, porque no es divertido cuando empiezas a escuchar ruiditos así en tu computadora o, o en tu vehículo, ¿verdad? Uh, no es con nada divertido, pero esa es la forma de decirlo. Funny noise. Un sonido raro, extraño. En el CPU. CPU. Yeah. En frozen screen. Se ha mojado la pantalla, está húmeda la pantalla. La pantalla frisada o congelada. Sí, la pantalla se congeló, es decir, se quedó ahí frisada, va quieto, o sea, se paralizó. No es que esté mojada, no es realmente congelada por hielo. Frozen, se quedó. Frozen screen. Así. Frozen. Ok. Congelada. Congelada, ¿no? O sea, se trabó, como decimos en buen salvadoreño. Quedó trabada. That is frozen screen. Ok. Now. Les voy a enviar una. Vamos a hacer una especie de eh, encuesta. Y ustedes van a escoger. Uh, let's see. How many can we check? Okay. The three most common problems or, or three most common reasons to call tech support. Okay. The three most common reasons to call tech support. Aquí les voy a enviar una encuesta. Ok, ahí, las, ahí la tienen. Marquen, por favor. The three most common for you. Yeah, de esos, escojan tres. ¿Tienen la encuesta a la vista? Ahí, sí, ahí está ya. Ya los veo trabajando en ella. Escojan tres. Vamos a ver el resultado. Ok. Nueve. Diez. Once. Ya la hicieron. Doce. Twelve. Thirteen.
14. Faltan tres. Bueno, hay dos que. Never participate. Let's see, I have too much light. Mm -hmm. That's that's better. Fifteen. Okay. Hay dos que creo que no. Okay. Let's finish the poll. Comparto los resultados. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Aquí están. Okay, look at the poll. According to you, which is the Number one reason to call tech support, according to, to you and the poll results. What is the number one reason to call tech support? No internet access. Um, internet access? Yes. No internet access. 11 of you think that no internet access is the number one reason to call tech support. No, the most of you, okay, 73% believe that this is one reason. This is the most common reason to call tech support. What is the number two, according to the poll? Virus. Look at the poll. Vean los resultados. Present screen. Frozen screen, yeah. Frozen screen is the number two. Yeah. Hey, aquí se me pierde. Frozen screen with 67%. What is the third one? What is number three? Virus. Virus. A virus. 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 Yeah, a virus. A virus. With the 53%. Then number four would be new software. Then USB ports out of order. Then delete the files, papers, talk, and funny noise. Okay. These are the results of this poll. Very good. So according to you, Okay, no internet access, it was one. What are the other frozen screen? What are the other? Virus. Yes. Virus. Three marks come. Okay, very good. Now, now look at, let's read these uh, ways to report a problem. 
this vocabulary or this language about ways to report a problem. Okay. And uh, I mean, ways to report a problem and common issues common issues to report. Let me read this language here. Ways to report a problem. I would like to report a problem. I would like to report an issue. I have trouble with common issues to report. It does not seem to work. It makes a strange noise or it makes a funny noise. It does not turn on. Okay. Let's practice. Repeat after me this phrase. I would like to report a problem. I would, I would like, like to report, to report a problem. problem. I would like to report an issue. I would like to report an issue. I have trouble with. I, I have, have I trouble have with. with. So you could say, I have trouble with my computer. I have trouble with my printer. I have trouble problem with my facts. I have trouble with uh, the photocopier. I have trouble with, uh, I don't know, whatever, okay? Now common issues to report. It doesn't, it does not seem to work. It, it, it does, does not, not seem, seem to, work. to work. It does not seem to work. It makes a strange or funny noise. It, oh, make, make, it makes a strange oh, funny, funny noise. noise. It does not turn on. It, it does, does not turn, turn, on. Turn, it on. Does not turn on. Turn on. Okay. I would like to share with you this other way to, because it's very common to use the expression, the, the expression, it won't, it won't. Para decir algo que el equipo que estamos reportando debería hacer y no está haciendo. Por ejemplo, it won't print. So, el impresor debería de imprimir. Cuando decimos it won't print, estamos diciendo no imprime. O, por ejemplo, the microwave won't hit. The microwave won't hit. El microondas no calienta. The freezer won't freeze. The TV won't turn on. Y así, ¿no? Para hablarnos de... Para expresar lo que un equipo no está haciendo. ¿Qué es lo que debería de hacer? Ya. Usamos la expresión it won't. O won't. ¿No? Queremos decir que no está haciendo eso. Que debería estar haciendo. Ok. Y para afirmar que sí está trabajando. It's working. It is working. Sí está funcionando. It's printing. Sí está imprimiendo. It's heating. Sí está calentando. Yeah. Ok. Now, in this chart, you have to write 
what are some common issues or problems you have at work? Okay. Write down the most common problems you have with your equipment in your office. Write the problems you and your classmate have in common in the middle section. Ok, primero hagan una lista acá de los problemas que ustedes suelen tener. Ya. Yeah. At work. Luego acá escribirán los de algún classmate. Y luego acá, los que tal vez tienen en común. Ustedes con su clase. ¿Ya? Ok. I will send you to work in pairs again. Let's Okay, join your groups, please, then write your common issues, your classmates' common issues, and compare. Hello. My dear. Andres, okay. Parece que tu internet no te deja entrar al grupo. Sí, teacher, bien raro porque en negro tenía la pantalla, no podía ver nada. Voy a intentar a ver si me puedo volver a, no sé si me puede volver a agregar. Ah, bueno, bueno. Por favor. 
Me va hoy.
Okay. <clears throat> I hope you finished writing about your common problems or your your common uh, yeah your common problems with uh, equipment with technology at work okay <clears throat> now. I want you to prepare a conversation, a similar conversation like this. But if you observe, this conversation is incomplete. See? Let me ask you some questions. Okay, so what I want you to do is that you prepare a conversation talking about the, the problems that you commonly have using one of your problems. You're going to simulate, to pretend that you are calling tech support, okay? Good morning, this is Saul from Tech Support. How can I help you? Hi, Saul. Uh, this is Juan. I am calling from the warehouse. I will. I have a problem with uh, the printer. It's, it is not working or the printer is not printing or Okay. Oh, and, and it's uh, okay. Uh, let me ask you some question. And then you have to write the question and ask the question. Okay. For example, uh, le va a preguntar unas tres preguntas, ¿verdad? Típicas que le hacen a uno. Ah. Uh, Está conectado a la corriente, qué sé yo. Está conectado al internet. Eh, no tiene papel atascado, qué, qué sé yo. Ustedes invéntense algo ahí. Y el otro le responde. Ya, o sea, hay que darle continua, continuación a esa conversación. Ok, está ahí. Bueno, no a este exactamente, sino. Esta se queda en, déjame hacerte unas preguntas. Me explico, entonces, ustedes, su problem, su, el problema que van a reportar, y el otro, el de Tech Support, haciéndole algunas preguntas para identificar el problema. ¿Ok? Entonces, una conversación parecida a esta, pero que continúa un poco más. Eso es lo que van a preparar. ¿Está claro? Yes, teacher. Yes, teacher. Ok. Vamos de nuevo a los mismos grupos. Ok. Go to your groups, please, and prepare the conversation.
te avisé ahí en el... Porque Pero no me así sale. ahorita, ahorita te pongo que, cómo se Ay, va a jugar sí, Fuerza. ya me sale, ya vi. Ay, lo siento. Vaya, entonces cuando te pregunte eso, tú, le, tú, me, vas a, tú me vas a decir, yes, right, o yes, right. La cajera. Yo soy la cajera de Super Selectors. Teacher, I have a question. Ajá. Is it correct say cash register? Uh, caja registradora, is it correct? Yes. Ah, okay. That is it. Okay, that is the question. <laughs> okay. Okay. Y entonces le diría yo. Oh, ok. Ahí. Luego de let me ask you some questions. ¿Daría alguna respuesta o directamente te hago las preguntas? Mm. Yo te puedo decir ok, good. Ajá. Uh -huh. Have you tried restarting your modem? Me entiendes, sería. Has a 214 volts. Mira, ve aquí donde, donde en el segundo I have the closet of bulbs. Yes, sería, bueno, sería la pregunta, do you have a closet bulb? Oops. Hola. Ajá, Vladimir, este. Vaya vale, las mías. Tengo dos y usted cuántas. Como que preguntarlo es: ¿el router está. Eh, bueno, ¿qué colores tiene el router? <ríe> ah, ¿Qué colores tiene el router? El, 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 ¿Qué colores tiene los tiene indicadores? El... De... Ajá, ah, cabal. Sí. Pero en inglés, ¿cómo se escribe eso?
Okay. Everybody's ready? Okay, very good. Let's see. Volunteers? Okay. Rosalina and Julio. <clears throat> okay. <laughs> Are you ready? Lights, hey, camera, hey. and action. Good morning. He is a Cesar from Tech Support. How can I help you? Hi, Cesar. This is Esme Esmeralda. I am calling from the Human Resource Department. I'd like to report a problem with my printer is not working. What is on? Esmeralda? It doesn't seem to work. In. I see a Let me ask you some question. Yes? Uh, yes. Your diabetes is connected to power? Yes, I write. Your diabetes is connected to internet? Yes, I write. Okay, Emeralda, you often have this problem. Sometimes I have a problem. Okay. Hasta ahí, teacher. Okay. <laughs> and the solution. Ya está resuelto. Okay, tírela a la basura ya. Cómprate uno nuevo, ya no sirve. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, very good. Thank you. Applause Thanks. to you. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Now, Andres and his group. Andres, uh, Alison, and Carla. Okay. Okay. Ready? Light, camera, action. Good evening. Thanks for calling from Sarsa Prosa. How can I help you? Hi, good evening. I am a cashier from Super Selectus and I have a problem the cash register won't open. Okay, so do you verify if the computer is connected to power? Yes, I do. Hello, I am the manager of the Super Selectos. Can you, can you give me the instruction to the make it work the cash register? Yes, follow the instruction. Restart the computer, check all cables, and use the key from cash register. Okay, so we don't, yeah, that's it. We don't do the, the finish. <laughs> no, no, that sounds good. Okay. Okay. I was waiting for the, the manager and the cashier to, <laughs> to do the, to follow the instructions. But okay. <laughs> okay. Very good. Applause to you. Excellent. Now, uh, Daniel has his hand up. Daniel and Noe. Okay. Okay, ready? Pay okay. light, camera, action. Good morning, Noe. This is Daniel from Tech Support. How I can help you? Hi, Daniel. This uh. Gustavo, I calling for the 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 pump department. I like the to report a problem why my pump. Okay, no. I, what is your problem with with your pump? I doesn't uh, seem to work. Oh, I see. 
let me ask you some question. You check the main break in the bolt? Yes, I check the, the bolts has 214 bolts. That's good. Do you have a closet bulb? Oh, yes, I have closet a bulb. Okay, please open the bulb. Okay, the, the pump to run. That's good. Can I help you with something else? Th thank you, Daniel. The problem is solving. Thanks. Okay, goodbye. Okay, very good, very good. Nice service. <clears throat> yeah, he asked for if he could help with any other problem. Yeah, perfect, very good. Excellent. Okay, who's next? Edwin. Edwin and... Hi. And Omar, okay, very good. Thank you very much. Here, lights, camera, okay. and action. Good afternoon. This is Edwin from Tech Support. How can I help you? Hi, Edwin. This is Omar. I'm calling from the expansion department. I'd like to report a problem with my internet access. Can you tell me what's wrong with your internet, Omar? I don't have access to the corporate network. I see. Let me ask you some questions. Okay, good. Have you tried restarting your router? Yes, it is the first thing I did, but the problem continues. I understand. Have you tried connecting to the same network with a different device? Yes, my cell phone is connected to the network with without problems. Okay, I know what, what the solution to your problem is, Omar. Let me make some adjustments to your network with, from my computer. That's so great. Can you try again, Omar? Yes, I have access to the internet. Thank you. I'm here to help you, Omar. Thanks for calling tech support. Wow, excellent. Excellent service. Very good. Thank, Thank you. you. Nice. Applause to you. Okay, who's next? Come on, voluntarily. Okay, Vladimir and Virginia. Very good. Okay. Ready? Light, Hi. camera, action. Hi, my name is Virginia. I want uh, to spare when the person and child detects support. Hello, my name is Vladimir and I'm from a technology department. How can I help you? I like to report a problem in my computer. Okay, I see. Uh, what happened with it? My, my computer does not have it. Um, Access internet. Oh, I see. Do you have your home Wi Fi on? Um, just is connection. Okay, try resetting your Wi Fi, please. Just is working. Okay, bye bye. Uh, thank you very much. Okay, okay very good. Usually that is the solution, yeah, for some. <laughs> <laughs> easy, easy. Yeah, but usually that is the solution. Okay, restart it, please. <laughs> oh, I'm going to restart it for you. So. Okay, very good. Congratulations, applause. Applause to you too. 
Okay. Who's next? No volunteers. One, two. Okay, quienes faltan? Vamos a ver Julio y Rosalina ya pasaron. Andrés, Carly y Alison, Edwin en Omar, Daniel en Noel, Virginia en Vladimir, Only Salvador en Gilberto, are missing. <laughs> Ahora levanta la mano. <laughs> <laughs> okay, go ahead. We say lights, camera, action. Microphone, Gilberto. Wow. Don Gilberto. The microphone. We cannot hear you. Berto, the microphone. Se perdió. No lo escuchamos. Hoy sí. Yes. Hello, Salvador. I am calling to report a problem. Hi, Gilbert. How can I help you? I am calling from the Global Import Spy. I'd like to report to problem. What is it, Gilbert? I have an issue with internet connection, and I had a issue with printer. I see. Let me ask you some question. What color of indicator show the router? And please check that the printer is connected to the network. The router show red light in the printer is not connects in the network. Okay, noted. I support with Team Viewer to resolve. Thank, Thank you me. very much. <laughs> okay, okay, very good. Excellent. Very good. <clears throat> okay. Uh, Déjeme decirles, a todos les, les comprendí cuál era el problema, cuáles eran los pasos para resolverlo. O sea, claro que no es un perfecto inglés, claro que hay todavía dificultades, pero se les entiende y eso es lo que debemos de valorar. ¿Ya? Por supuesto que van a ir puliendo. Este es apenas el módulo 2. ¿Ok? No tienen que ir puliendo. Tienen que ir mejorando su pronunciación. La estructura de las oraciones. ¿Verdad? Eso va a ir mejorando. Pero nuestro objetivo es communication. Comunicarnos. Darnos a entender. ¿Ya? Y eso lo estamos haciendo. ¿Ok? Lo estamos haciendo. Entonces, ¿verdad? Eh, algo que hay que vencer siempre es ese, es ese miedo. ¿No? Porque a veces, eh, bueno, ni el español hablamos perfecto. ¿No? Mucho menos un idioma nuevo. No lo vamos a a manejar a la perfección. Pero 
lo importante es comunicarnos. Podernos comunicar, poder comprender a los demás y poder transmitir nuestras ideas. ¿Ok? Ese es eh, eh, el objetivo. ¿De acuerdo? Y en eso vamos, en eso vamos. Apenas es el módulo 2, apenas estamos en básico. ¿Ya? Vamos, trabajemos en eso y ese sea siempre nuestro objetivo. ¿Ok? Comunicar. Ustedes ven, los gringos vienen y, y hablan su español chapuceado y todo, pero se les entiende. Nos comunicamos. ¿Ok? Ahora en persona, entre, entre hablar y, y señales, nos comunicamos. Vamos a ir perfeccionando, vamos a ir puliendo. Tenemos 16 módulos por delante para todo eso. Si es que eh, no eh, perdamos esa, eso, no, eso eh, objetivo, comunicarnos, que nos entiendan y entender. Very good. Congratulations. Good job. Thank okay. you. Thank you, teacher. Thank you. Okie dokie. Now, let's take the last attendance of the evening, okay? Alison Andrea Serrano. Present teacher. Carla Yasmin Rivera. Present. Carlos Jonathan García. Daniel Ernesto Membreño. Present, good night. Good night, Elwin Mauricio Pineda. Present, good night everyone. Eric Mauricio Cruz. Present. Okay. Gilberto Benito Santa María. Present teacher, good night. Good night, Jennifer Guadalupe Elías. José Andrés Martínez. Present teacher, good night. Good night. Eh, Julio César Fabián. Present. See you tomorrow. See you. Noé Gustavo Núñez. Present teacher. Good night. Good night. Omar Alexander Chávez. Present teacher. Good night. Good night. Raúl Edgardo Sarceño. Rosalina Esmeralda Sánchez. Present teacher. Good night. Good night. Salvador Alberto Soriano. Present. Ok, Virginia del Carmen Vázquez. Hey, don't Present, don't teacher. Go. Vladimir Alejandro García. Present, good night. Good night. William Bori Roque. Present, good night. Ok. Ok, people, that's all for today. Remember, complete exercises from Unit 3. And uh, start with Unit 4. Good night. Stay with Bye, teacher. Bye bye, Rosalind. Okay, Salvador. Uh -huh, teacher. Well, this time is just to help you with any problem, any. Uh, Anything that you would like to, to ask, alguna pregunta, duda, cosas que reforzar. Esa es la idea de estos minutos. <risa> Gracias. Este, sí, todavía no me acostumbra a esto de las tareas. Este, por cierto, yo también soy uno de los que todavía, bueno, estoy terminando la tarea 15. Aquí de así dice tarea 15, pero no sé, unidad 3, tarea 15. Dice. Sí, sería ya la, la tarea 5 de la unidad 3, correcto. Ah, Son sí, cinco, así sería. Cinco tareas por unidad, o una por día. Ah, ok. Como vamos, okay. son cuatro unidades, cuatro semanas, son 20 tareas por todo. Más los exámenes. Ah, ok. Entonces ahorita tengo que, tengo que terminar hasta la 15, hasta la 16. No, hasta la 16. 
Sí, ya es la 16, ya es la primera tarea de la unidad 4. O sea, la de esta unidad que empezamos hoy. Exacto, es la, es la tarea de hoy. Es ah, tarea? ok, ok. Este, pues realmente. Ok. Pues realmente no tengo este. Bueno, no sé usted cómo me escucha. <risa> este. Y o, o cómo me doy a entender de alguna manera, ¿verdad? Si, si estoy más o menos en, en el curso correcto también. <risa> este. O adecuado para mi aprendizaje. Sí, sí, yo, yo creo que sí, no sé si tú cómo lo sientes. Sí, no, no lo siento pesado. Sí, yo, yo veo sí, que captas siento. por lo menos la, la, la estructura, la forma, si las captas bien. En lo que como todos hay que ir trabajando es en la asociación, ¿verdad? Ahí es, es lo que todos hay que hacer, ¿verdad? Estar escuchando para lo que decía ayer. Estar escuchando, sí. escuchando para ir mejorando el oído, al mejorar el oído, va a mejorar nuestra producción. Ah, ok. Este, en la, en la unidad, en, la, en el módulo anterior, yo inicié de una sola vez en el módulo 2 no inicié en el módulo 1. Este, pero okay. no es mucho lo que me, me ¿cómo? Este es el 2. Este es el 2, ¿verdad? Sí. Y yo entré de una sola vez a este, al dos. Ah, no tomaste el 1. Ah, ok. No tomé el 1. Ajá. Okay. Entonces no sé de, de qué me he perdido o si estoy bien según el, el módulo para... Ya vamos al 3 realmente, ¿verdad? Sí. Pues básicamente en el módulo 1 se ve eh, lo que hemos visto hasta ahora también. Simple present, verbo to be. Um, creo que se ve un poco de la, de la hora. Eh, de posiciones. On, in, at. Pero que se vuelven a ver. ¿verdad? Este, este curso está diseñado para ir retomando las cosas e, e irlas profundizando un poco más en cada módulo. ¿Verdad? Ah, ok. Entonces, sí, se, se vuelven a ver. Incluso parte de lo que hemos visto en este módulo se vio en el 1, solo que un poquito más avanzado en este. Así es que... Eh, ah, ok. Yo siento que por mí, yo siento que te has adaptado bien. O sea, no, no se nota que te haga falta tomar el uno. Ah, ok, ok. Eso me preocupaba. <risa> pero, pero igual yo me puse, no me puse, sino que supuestamente, según el examen que hice, este, porque antes de entrar me dijeron, haga, esta, haga este cuestionario. Mm. Yo lo hice y me dijeron que era módulo, podía irme al módulo 5, principiante 5. Ah. Yo, yo puche que dije. Mm, y le pregunté, ¿verdad? Mira, pero ¿cómo es aquí la forma de estudio? Porque, porque realmente no sé. Este, sí. Entonces, por eso fue que cuando vi yo que la forma de estudio, no, pero no, mandéjeme en el 2. Fue que quisiera ir siguiendo la secuencia, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. Para que no después me digan, usted que no estuvo en el módulo, <risa> en el módulo anterior. Sí, sí, sí. No, me parece buena decisión, ¿verdad? Porque esto no es una, no es una carrera, bueno, no sé, si, si tienes prisa, pues, ¿verdad? Eh, <risa> es mejor llevarlo con calma y aprender bien, sentar buenas bases. Ahora, si tuvieras prisa, pues, tal vez, vamos. Igual, es inversión de tiempo, eso sí, va, porque son, son cuatro, cuatro módulos, ¿verdad?, que vas a cursar. Eh, 
Pero vale la pena, punto yo. Vale la pena. Sí. Sí, ok. Sí, no, realmente, este, en relación a, a otra cosa más, no, no tengo ninguna duda, sola, como le decía, esto de la, acostumbrarme a esto de la de las tareas, aquí va a ir a hacerlas. Ah, <ríe> sí, Nada sí, más, sí. pero. Sí, como es tu primer módulo, ¿verdad? Sí, manejar la plataforma. Sí, la plataforma, eh, un poquito, está diseñada como tú ves el curso en cinco, en cuatro unidades, cuatro secciones, dice ahí, ¿verdad? Section one, two, three, and four, son las cuatro unidades, exactamente las cuatro semanas. Cada sección tiene cinco tareas, que son los cinco clases que vemos por unidad. La sección dos tiene las cinco tareas, y al final de la sección dos, el examen de mitad del curso. Okay. Y luego las unidades, sección 3, sección 4 y el examen final. Está al final de la sección 4. Entonces, de 5 en 5 va. ¿No? Ah, eso es lo que no le, no le hallaba y no me había adelantado. <risa> Así es como va. Porque sí se podía adelantar, nos, de, nos, de, nos decía. ¿verdad? Sí. Se puede, se puede, no hay problema. Así ok. Es que dale ahí, ¿verdad? Ah, voy a terminar voy a eso entonces, pero... Uh -huh. <ríe> Vaya, buenísimo. Perfecto, Salvador. Uh -huh. Hasta feliz noche. No, hombre. Uh -huh. Gracias, hombre, y feliz noche también. Ok. <ríe> Goodbye. Bye.